Hi everyone, this is Firan and welcome to Study Windows. Today we are going to learn luminous and illuminated or non-luminated objects. So what we learned in our earlier video? Introduction to light. What is light? Its basic introduction, its characteristic. And we know light helps us to see things around us. Do you know what is luminous and illuminated object? Before that, we will see an example here. No, so this is a very dark space. Are you able to see anything here? No. Now are you able to see anything? Yes, because there is a torch light and light from the torch is falling on a girl and we are able to see the girl. Here you can see there are two distinct things. One, so the objects which can give or emit light is known as luminous object. And second one, the objects which doesn't produce light but capable of reflecting light to our eyes. That's the girl. It's an object. It cannot produce light but capable of reflecting it and it is known illuminated object. So we understand based on light sources, there are two types of objects, luminous object and illuminated objects. So luminous object can produce light and illuminated objects cannot produce light, they can reflect light only. Luminous objects example like sun, sun is the ultimate source of light in our universe. We get light from sun. So sun is a luminous object, bulb, at the night we switch on our bulb and we are able to see, so bulb gives light, so it's a luminous object and in the same way torch, torch gives light, so torch is a luminous object, these are known as luminous object. And illuminated objects, examples, book or pen or chair or stones, anything which cannot give light, which cannot produce light but only able to reflect. These are known as illuminated objects. Now I will ask you a very simple question. Why we can see book or pen or chairs or any other illuminated objects although they are not producing light? It's very simple because take an example, sun is a luminous object so sun can produce light. So light is coming from sun and it is falling on the chair. From the chair the light bounces back to our eyes and we can see the chair. In the same way, instead of chair, we can see the person. So light is falling on the person and again the light bounces back to our eyes and we can see the people. And if you take football, it is the same thing. And even you can take an example for apple. Here light is falling on apple and, and it bounces back to our eyes and we can see the apple. So in that way, we see all illuminated objects with the help of light or luminous object. Now how do we see illuminated objects? So very simple, light comes from illuminated objects to our eyes directly. So we see, but don't look the sun bare eyes, you can get hurt. And same way bulbs, light comes from bulbs directly when we can see the bulbs and torch light, everything is same. These all are same. Now characteristics of luminous objects. Object which has its own light. Light is generated or emitted or produced or comes only from luminous objects. Luminous objects are responsible for our vision. Example, we have already discussed sun, candle, bulb, firefly, etc. And characteristic of illuminated objects, object which doesn't have its own light, capable of reflecting lights to our eyes. We see these objects because of luminous objects only. Example, books, paint, trees, pencils, etc. Differences Sometimes we confuse 
sun or bulb or torch or plants, apple, football. So don't be confused. We can easily categorize luminous and illuminated objects. Let's see the differences. Luminous object and illuminated object. So luminous objects produce light. Illuminated objects not able to produce lights. Luminous objects are independent. Illuminated objects depends on luminous objects. Luminous objects itself are the source of lights. Illuminated objects are visible only when light reflects of them. Examples Luminous objects stars, candles, tube light. Illuminated objects book, table, tree, stones. Look at this picture. It is at the night. Are you able to see this bright thing? What is it? Is it luminous or illuminated objects? And why? It's a moon. So we will see whether moon is luminous or illuminated objects. Earth is moving around sun and moon is moving around earth. So sometimes the moon is in a position where the sunlight is falling on the moon and then it is reflected. See, sunlight is falling on the moon and it is reflected to our earth and we can see. So from the earth you can see the moon. Moon doesn't have its own light, although it is bright at night. Moon is illuminated object. Do you know there are some fishes or insects are luminous object like firefly. You can see the light of the firefly, uh, jellyfish or anglefish. This all has light and these all are luminous object. Do you know? whether glass is transparent or translucent or opaque object? Check out our next videos. Thank you so much for watching and stay tuned for our next videos.